I don't have a clue what we're gonna do. 25 bucks. Welcome to the vlog guys again, Matchy as always. Thanks so much for watching and today just a way to celebrate July 4th. I want to get a, a flag. Well, technically we have a flag already on the tailgate, but I want to get like a real flag. And uh, normally I plan my videos ahead of time. Like I know what are we going to do, how are we going to do all the kind of stuff. But today we don't. I don't have a clue what are we going to do, how I'm going to do. So I have to go to Home Depot to buy some stuff. Then I will figure out a way. Sorry, it's a mask here. Uh, I'll figure out a way to put it like right there. Somewhere right there. So yeah, that's today's plan. I think the truck needs a flag so bad. And then we'll see, we'll see how that goes. I have no clue how that's gonna be. I hope that's gonna work out because I really want a flag. A long time I want a flag. Well, we'll see, Home Depot, here you go. That's gonna be my pole. I think it's gonna work. I really do. That brake caliper, though. Sweet. Oh boy, truck looking good. Sounding good. I really need to figure out what to do next to make faster. You guys gonna hear my opinion. I have a strong statement to make next video. So back to the garage. We are back home after Home Depot. I always love to go to Home Depot. Not really because I always spend money and because we are talking about flags in general. Uh, I really appreciate you guys last video on the Corvette and toy with the Colorado. Uh, but some people Dude, you guys pay so much attention on my videos and I really appreciate your comments and everything else. And for the first time ever, I think people comment in a good way and I always listen to you guys. That's why if you wanna leave your comment, I normally read all the comments and try to reply. I don't, I just don't like when people take personal. Like, you know, if you don't like me, that's fine. No offenses, I'm fine with all the, uh, the comments and you know if things we disagree that's life i really appreciate it so some people saw that i have a flag there well i'm learning the flag is in the wrong way there's a stand way to put the flag there so we're gonna fix that right now boom there we go american flag fixed it uh let me know what you guys think and i'm sorry i'm so sorry that i put it in the wrong way and I really appreciate you guys' help telling me the right way and to do. So as you guys can see here, my garage is a mess. We are under renovation in some parts of her house. So it is what it is. Nothing can park here. Every time we are doing construction, I move the Corvette out. But anyway, so today's a flag day. If you guys don't know, I'm Brazilian. And maybe I'll tell you my story soon. So I'm Brazilian, but I'm American as well. And that's my soccer team. Now, I also need some Seattle Seahawks. Yeah, I'm Seattle Seahawks as well. But flag one down, let's go to the flag two. Actually, flag three because that's flag two. Uh, we're going flag three. So what I did, I bought some stuff from Home Depot, which is actually the flag. I got this as my pole. First of all, it's black. I think it's gonna be good with black. And I also got this to make like my my flag stand and also got some more stuff that i'll show you guys what we're gonna do with if that works and I, i'm really excited and i hope that works because if it don't i don't know what we're gonna do i don't know what i'm gonna say about this video but i hope that does it's very simple i think i spent like i don't know 25 bucks the most expensive one was the flag itself because I did the one on one, I got like a good one. I got one uh, three by five. You know, it's good for wind and, and wet. So that's, I just want a good flag. It was 20 bucks for the flag. And I think I spent another 
eleven dollars for the rest of this stuff. So my plan is I you know unfortunately I cannot use the cover with the flag unless I use the hitch, which is not the case. Maybe I buy something down the road, but not right now. I'm gonna just roll the 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 cover and we're gonna I'm gonna show you guys where we're gonna mount the flag. If my idea works, if it works. <laughs> Here's my idea, right? Because I got all this stuff, I'm gonna use this hook here and I'm also gonna use this piece here just to make sure probably it's gonna be more, more like attached to this part than this part. So I got this steel kind of thing because I don't think it's going anywhere. So I think it's gonna stay right here and then I'm gonna use it's really hard to show with one hand. As I said, I got this pole here and this is going to be here attached with this piece here, which I don't know the name. It's kind of a clamp, right? Uh, and then we're gonna attach to the, this thing here. And the idea is to use the bed cover hardware to make even more stable. So why I'm doing this is just because I don't want to drill any holes in my truck. And overall, let's not put the flag on the mat. That just cost me, what, $14 at Home Depot. So plus the flag, and if you have the flag, you can do for $14, you know what I'm saying? So I will try to do it and we're gonna see how that goes. Okay, so I use that clamp here on the bottom and I put some zip ties here uh, on the top and as you guys can see it's not going anywhere like it's definitely not going anywhere see like and then I'm gonna use this thing here to attach the flag and we should be good so I cannot believe I did this so fast never works and did work and I'll explain to you guys why I'm doing this cheap way, but let's get that done. Let me finish, put the, the flag there. Here's the final product. Uh, the flag is a little bit big, but it's okay. I think it's gonna look cool. Again, I'll explain to you guys why I'm doing this way because it's cheap, you know, I'm not spending too much money, but let's take for a ride and see how that goes. Uh, it's so hot in New Jersey though. Could be a little bit longer, but it's looking good so far. I love it. I drove for like five, ten minutes, and that thing looks solid. I think you guys can see a little bit here. Uh, of course, I'm not trying highways, uh, which I don't think I ever will. But yeah, I mean, for 11 bucks though, it cannot be that. I cannot use my cover, which is fine. The, the weather is nice, uh, but that's the only thing. So I'll explain you guys why I did this in this way. Okay, the flag is still there. As I said, the pole could be a little bit like longer, but it's fine going down the road was fine so we have flags on flags flags on flags on flags on flags on flags I know. enough of that so there's a hook there that's the size hook that i'm using i'm using that kind of clip and some zip ties a pole it's this thing is not going anywhere see the truck shakes when i do this but and they're just a regular flag if you want to get something bigger 
just get something bigger if you want to get something longer you know what i'm saying like it's better it's gonna look better the reason why i did this way and cost me like 14 dollars was just because i'm not gonna use that every single day since the truck is my daily driver and i don't want to spend a lot of money that was the last time idea because i want to have the flag on for july 4th and that's it i hope you guys enjoy 14 dollars you cannot beat that that's it guys i hope you guys enjoy today's upload that just way to do something really cheap i hope you guys enjoy so before we leave make sure to follow me instagram i posted two days ago that me and just we are getting together again one more time and this time we are inviting you to come and hang out with us so it's gonna be so much fun we are doing pa because pa is like half of the way for me and half of the way for justin so if you're leaving new jersey you want to meet somewhere and drive to pa that would be so much fun let me know follow me on instagram or leave your comment below so we can arrange how we're gonna do that but save the date in our calendar july 28th but it's gonna be so much fun we're gonna hang out just to is inviting his subscribers as well. I'm probably gonna have a lot of Colorados and a lot of Corvette. This time I'm probably just taking the, the truck. The Corvette's not making the trip this time. So even if you are from New York, we can also meet in New Jersey and drive to PA and spend the day together, have lunch, have so much fun, talk about cars and trucks, see all the modifications, it's gonna be so much fun. So make sure to save the date july 28th yeah that's it for today i hope you guys enjoy happy july 4th and i'll see you guys next video as always don't forget enjoy life